First on five, Mobile police say they have made several arrests in connection to the couple found dead after a house fire in Happy Hills last year. WKRG News 5's Nicolette Schleisman has been pushing police for answers and found out three people are now in custody, each charged with two counts of murder and multiple counts of shooting into an occupied home. All I hear the boom. It sounded like a bunch of shots. Almost exactly a year after Tony and Leela Lewis were found dead in their home after this fire, Mobile police say they're thankful to bring their family some sort of closure. It's just a beginning, but uh, it's a good beginning. Police have charged person of interest Darren Southall, Terrence Watkins, and Jamarcus Chambers, all with murder. I think we've just done the easiest part. Even though it took us a year to get here, We've just done the easiest part. We put handcuffs. We're going to be putting handcuffs on them, and finally, getting them before the courts to answer for for the crimes that were committed. A fire broke out at the Lewis's home on Dr. Thomas Avenue the evening of February 17th, 2021. Police confirmed Tony Lewis was shot multiple times. Family confirms the couple's grandson is local rapper Honeycomb Brazy, whose real name is Nashawn Jones. He posted to Instagram he was sorry his grandparents got, quote, caught up in his mess. Police aren't releasing details as to what happened. Instead, waiting for that to play out in court. We spent some time talking with the family and let them know that the day has come. <laughs> and so um, the, the idea that their patience and their perseverance has paid off. When South Hall was named a person of interest, police confirmed they were looking into the connection between South Hall and Honeycomb Brazy and were trying to confirm a previous beef between the two. In Mobile, Nicolette Schleisman, WKRG News 5.